Hello, everyone. My apologies, because I realized that I just completely forgot to, like, continue this. I think we're gonna go fight Nimona or something, or did we already do that? We already did that, didn't we? Um... What were we doing? I did not even do that. Stick drift or something, but what were you? We're doing the gym leaders, right? Yeah, or did we already get through with all the gym leaders? No, wait, we already got through with all of them. We just gotta go do the tournament, right? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Wow. How long has it been? Like, a week? Two weeks? Who we? Three weeks? I had no clue. I honestly cannot say. I have no idea. Wow. I think what it was is I stopped and then I wanted to fight all the, like, squad leaders again. Before I went in all this, but I don't care anymore, so I'm gonna just do this. Yes. Oh yeah, I wanted to like train up a little bit. I think I accomplished that goal, but you'll see. You'll see. I think last time we ended off and our Pokemon was all like level 70 or something, I don't know. It's been a little while. <clears throat> the champions. That's me. Yep, there I am. In, a, in my motorcycle helmet. Yippee, let's brawl like Super Smash Bros. or Multiverses. <clears throat> Aren't you the rock guy? Yeah, I'm sure you can see my dumbfounded expression through this tinted motorcycle helmet, as I've already stated. Let's handle business. So, last time we fought him, he was almost nothing to scoff at, right? Okay, I'm liking this music. After I beat this Greedent, I'm gonna switch into Coridon, maybe. Don't oh, paralyze and we'll be Gucci. Fun fact. Body Slam has a 33% chance of paralyzing, while Thundershock and Thunderbolt only have a 10% chance. Scovillain. Intrigue stressing. This music is actually a bop, though. I like this. Protosynthesis. Yeah, my attack. Okay, so that'll help my earthquake. <clears throat> nice. 100 base power plus stab. That's 130. Plus, I think, a double boost. So somewhere around 200, maybe. I don't know. I'm just pulling those numbers out of my booty cheeks, but I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, this one. Be faster. Boom, Bubba. 
Wow, they're just flim all in my throat cavity. Oyster. Water ice or water rock? Yeah, water ice? Yeah. Okay. We may just sweep. If we do, that'll be perfectly fine by me. Gardenacle, we better save Coridon. I don't think we get a heal, but oh, I should have used the other one. Works. Yeah, I knew most of his team was like weak to fighting. Mad boss stiff, probably gonna terrestrialize into dark, so we're good. This is a lovely beat, though. I'm liking this. That does not matter at all. He may pull us a little trick here. He may terrestrialize into something different, but I don't think so. Nope. You're cooked. It, it is over. Uh-huh. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> wow, we... Tough luck, my guy. Oof. What was that, a no-hip? No, wait, we had body slam on Meowscarada. Well, darn. Okay. <clears throat> we may be slightly over-leveled. Who knows? Cool. Cool. You know it. Uh-huh. Jacques, the biology teacher. <clears throat> Surely you're nothing special, right? You may be using grass types. Or you could just have your own champion team. Okay, fire. You're fire. We don't have anything for that. If anything, we have... Actually, nothing at all for that, so. Yep. Oh, rain, too. That's lovely. When did it start raining? Flare Blitz will be useless. Uh, hurt yourself. 65. Oof. That's a bit better, but... I used to use close combat a lot during Platinum on my Infernape. But I realized real quick, during the Cynthia battle, using close combat was... Surefire way to get absolutely dunked on. I don't know what Cynthia's Infernape was on during Brilliant Diamond, but like if you all watch that episode, you know like its speed was off the charts. Like it was like it was almost like lightning speed. I don't understand it. It had to be EV training for a lot, because I think I was over 19 levels above it, maybe, or something? Or 9 levels? I don't know. I was quite a few above it, but my speed was still slower. I should have switched. This was this is the death of me. No, let's send it. We get healed. Okay. Ha. Um... 
Righty then. Right. Each life is usually disgustingly weak, but... I forgot about the lack of Pokemon we have to fight grass. Or bug. I don't think we have many to fight bug. I, I know that Paridon has Fire Fang. But I kind of want the other parts of the team to do some work. Since we don't really use them that often in normal game. Okay, so we're slower. Oh, uh, we're cooked. Great job, you've done amazing. What a loser, am I right? <laughs> okay. Righty then. Keep it. <clears throat> nice. Swallot. What is Swallot? Oh, is that the poison one? I don't think so, but... It is. Yeah, it is. That's nice. Um... You must be desperate. Because... That should have been the first Pokemon you pulled out, honestly. Would have been much better for you. Did he have a theme at all? I haven't been paying much attention. He had Arcanine, Slowbro, Lorantis. I think it was just Pokemon he's just been studying. Like, there is not much of a theme, right? Rigoraf. Just Crunch. Probably Psychic Normal, because that's what, um, Jirifraf was. I think that was what it was called, I don't know, I don't care. It hit it with the Alphabetical Slam. I don't know why I said Alphabetical so odd. Or why I said it at all, there was no reason to put that word there. Just as I anticipated. As long as it's not faster, I think we're good. We're good. Righty then. An extreme W, yet again. Cool. Yep, 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 be. Mm. I don't know what he said, but why not? Hold on, I have a secret tactic. We'll see what he said. No. Uh-huh. Did great. You're more fit for the teaching position than I am.
or there was nothing whatever I'm sure this is just gonna be a fighting type or something to do with fitness I don't, I don't care so far my assumption holds true steel fighting Them. Surely she doesn't have a Lucario. <laughs> if it's faster, we're cooked. It may have Aerial Ace. If it had it, it didn't use it. Tauros. Okay. This one's different than the other ones. Why? Why is this one different? Huh? Is it just a normal type that just happens to have fighting type moves? Okay. Um. This one's an odd one, right here. It wasn't. Huh. Must be an odd hyping. Metacham, Psychic, and Fighting. Psychic, Fighting, we have nothing for. We'll just go with Lumina Crash. I think it's super effective. And when I'm positive, is psychic is neutral to psychic, so we're good. Oh, never mind. There's no way. Yeah, that was not a. I've never seen that move. Now that I think about it, axe kick. A new one. Another Tauros. Wow, we're really reaching, huh? Excuse me? Counts it as a different Pokemon. What's up with its tail? Okay. Does Tauros have different typing depending on its form? I kind of like that actually. Cool. What does Osu mean? Maybe it's Osu because this it's region is based on Spanish culture. So maybe it's Osu. I don't know what that means, though. So... Hit him... Hit him with it. The one time we use Pluck. And it worked. Yippee. Terrestrialization is honestly not a great tactic unless you know you're gonna kill. It's more of a gloat. 
sometimes. It does have its, like, uses, though, because it effectively, like, powers up all your moves, so, like... I think if you use a, like, a psychic move in a, like, psychic terrestrialization, that's 1.5, and then if it's a stab, it'll also be 1.5, so it'll be 2 times instead of 1.5 times with stab, well, 1.3, right, is it 1.3? Whatever. I know it just boosts a bit more. It's path for a... Yeah. Cool. Let's do it. Um. Oh. Right. Okay. This is new. Is this Pathra just that tanky? I, I, I didn't check levels, so... Could just be, like, massive level. Honestly, though, Go Go is so underutilized in most Pokemon games. We're good. Alright. Awful move sending it out this early. But don't complain when the enemies make a mistake. Boom. Belusa Psychic. Psychic Water? Or just Psychic? I think it's Psychic Water. <clears throat> yeah. I'm I'm getting the names now. A well timed crit is always good. Avalug. Let's switch it up. Just a wee bit. I knew it was tanky, but I didn't think it survived that. But slam, Glamora? Is that your final again? Okay. I forgot you're typing, so... You can't have Levitate, so... What could your typing be? Poison. Yeah, that, that one was actually blindingly obvious, but... 
Ground type terrestrialization. This is a new. This is a new thing. Or not. Wood? Oh, rock type. Okay. It works out in the end. Lemore just does not seem like a rock type to me. Or a ground type or anything like that. What do we have? One more fight? Yeah, I think it's, um... Uh... What's her name? Namora? Namona. Yeah, that's what I said. What? What's happening? I thought there was a final round with, with the other one. Notice how her Pokemon were the same level as everyone else's. Cool. Uh huh. Hey, cool. It'll be a like regular thing. So maybe that means like like there's multiple things I can just do it again or something um okay this was just a mediocre side quest I guess Oh, a prize. I'll never wear that. Oh, yeah. Cool. Sure, I guess. Not dating. Get out of here. Scram, skedaddle. Um. Let's immediately save. Or we'll just go into a phone call. Yeah. <clears throat> Ooh. Surprisingly high raid battle. We can spare the time to go look at a raid battle. <laughs> uh, it's all part of my plan. The highest I've seen so far was like, like four star. So maybe we'll get like five or maybe even six star. Ooh! Do they go above six star? Or five star, I mean? Yep, these all look like normal raid battles to me. Since we're grass type, I want to look for raid battles that we have to our advantage. Like this, like these two. Huzzah. Do we get legendaries from these? Can we do that? That that'd be cool. I highly doubt it, but that reminds me we need to find the um. We need to find the thing with the thing, um, the the stakes everywhere. I've been pulling some out of the ground, but I've been just kind of just doing it in my spare time and not really as like anything special, but. Four star, but that's fighting. Uh, 
That's bug. Where the heck are they? Oh, they're over there. Cool. Bob and weave. Man, I keep mistiming that jump. Um, there's rock. And an HM. Yeah. The most gracious landing. Here, let's see how good the four star. Since I haven't done that on this channel yet. Or any channel, considering this is my only one. <laughs> that you know of. <clears throat> the phlegm. It's awful. Oof. Belly Bolt is going to be absolutely cheeks here. There's going to be no use. Mm-hmm. Hit him with it. That'll work. Okay. Get him, gang. No! That ain't getting him, gang. Come on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Electromorphosis does nothing in this scenario. Go away. And every time I've been doing a raid, I have been catching them, but I've not really been using them at all. I've been breeding Eevees, though. Turns out the breeding process in this game is actually very different. You have to go into a picnic with your Pokemon, and as long as, like, just have a ditto in your party, and then the Pokemon you want to breed... It will breed them at the same time, but the thing is, you have to actually go AFK for multiple, like, minutes. Like, if you don't have egg power, some sandwiches, it could take you a whole 25 or 30 minutes to get one egg because you have to, like, sit and wait in the picnic. <clears throat> so, like, you can't just exit out of the picnic. You have to be there. So. Egg powers, like, really help. But I don't have any sandwiches that make egg powers. So I've been, like, experimenting with it. And it takes so long to get a singular egg. And you have to go and claim them from the basket manually. Another four star... Masquerada does not have high defenses, so we can just go ahead and, like, get rid of them. Get it done, you know what I mean? Okay. Mm-hmm. <sighs> I hate these, like, status effects that lower everyone's stats. It just takes so long. Okay. Bro, Electromorphosis does nothing. 
Whatever. Bam. Get it done. Yep. <clears throat> I like how we hit a Batman pose and then just throw this and all that. Yeah. I don't see any special raids around here. Like, these are pretty mid, actually. Larry. Are these the raids? Is there something special? Because they just seem like normal raids to me. I guess I'll just have to find them, but like, th there really seems to be nothing special. While we're around here, we might as well just go and dispatch the Team Star bases once a game. We can handle business with Great Clips. Oh, I should probably just follow the abnormally large flags, right? I think what we do is we just walk up to the boss and just be like, hey, we're fighting again. All right. Could be a ye old tent, yeah. Sure. Still good music. The music crew went massive for this game. They did great. What was that? Huh. Get out of here. Sorry, I was just going silent there to admire all that now. Uh, firefighting. Fire ghost, fire dart, I think. Char Cadet evolves into it. It's a split evolution. Wow, it is just raining every time there's a fire type. We're not doing Mega Horn. Yeah, it, it rained on Arcanine too. In the other fight. Terrible luck. Wow, we right. Hound Doom. Yeah, we're good. I was picking up now.
During that whole segment there, I was just reminded of the SpongeBob SquarePants first movie. They're in the Goofy Goober song. SpongeBob was just like stringed up from the ceiling. Going full on magic wizard with the electric guitar in the like live action section where we were just shredding it. <laughs> <clears throat> So, what does that do? Do I just get an extra badge? What was that? Oh, it's just a daily challenge, okay. That's kind of boring. So there isn't even like a massive there isn't even like a big reason to fight him, huh? Okay, cool, cool. I know on one of these shrines were like just like a few pieces from getting the full puzzle like completed, but like I don't think it's this one, but I know we don't have many stakes. There has to be one around here, right? No, that's just a Pokeball. Hard to find them because they're all supposed to be hidden in inconspicuous places. Well, most of them. I think that's their whole deal. I thought there was a cave entrance there for a second. Did I just phase through the wall? No, no, I did not. Usually I would look up the like where they're found, but I actually for once want to do it by myself. There's a bug on my wall. Okay. Get out of the way, creature. You're much too low a level for me. I do love Great Tusk's design. Dunfan was too long abandoned by its father company. No longer. Maybe this means more OG Pokemon will get like a really cool update. Like Tauros did. I do love what they did with Tauros. That's, it's actually kind of cool. Okay, we get it. We, we, we're hopping. Let's go visit ye old shrine. Well, we're here. Oh, it is this one that was like almost done. Well. I guess that's a good place to end it off. So with that said, this has been Dream Master, and I'll see y'all next time.